two, one, ignition. After a slight delay, it's time for liftoff. Europa Clipper has begun its three billion kilometer voyage to a very mysterious moon which orbits Jupiter and could support life. The NASA spacecraft blasted off from Florida on Monday after Hurricane Milton postponed its departure last week. Its mission, to get a closer look beneath Europa's icy crust, where scientists are almost certain lies a vast ocean with double the amount of water on Earth. So far, no mission has got close enough to Europa to confirm this. They are generational quests. We have been dreaming, we scientists have been dreaming about a mission like Europa Clipper for more than 20 years. We've been working to build it for 10 years. And so it really is a very long-term investment and quest. Now there's hope that Europa Clipper, equipped with a laser and other instruments on board, will be able to map almost the entire moon and collect samples. It won't look for alien life, but instead the key ingredients necessary to sustain it. Given everything that we've really learned about necessary conditions for life, Clipper is going to tell us if Europa has all of these ingredients for life. So what we learned with Clipper and the habitability of Europa, this is going to pave the way for the future, for future missions to Europa and elsewhere in our solar system where we can search more directly for life. Europa Clipper won't arrive until 2030, but what it finds could change what we know about life in our solar system.